Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this Master Mode Vulture boss guide. Now first off, if you have a host, 5 5th champions, a duped 5 star Stark Tech Spidey, duped 5 star Iceman, I'm sorry to say this video simply is not for you. But before you disappear, please do like this video and also subscribe, that would help me out an awful lot. However, if you're thinking about playing through Master Mode for the first time, wondering what the boss fights would be like, or simply just looking for some advice on how to fight the Vulture, well congratulations, you have came to the correct place. This video will focus on the Vulture fight himself, so if you need any advice and tips on the past leading up to the Vulture in Master Mode, please do let me know in the comments below, and I will be sure to help you out as best I can. The fight itself is only around a minute long, so first of all I'm just going to let the fight play through before pointing out a few different things that I think will really help you when you come to fight the Vulture. So in this fight we're using Scarlet Witch, the Vulture will regain quite a lot of health during the course of the fight, so Scarlet Witch will help nullify that with her ability. Dr. Voodoo is another fantastic champ to use here, but if you don't have either of these champions, don't worry about it, it is still possible. You just want to make sure you fight very aggressively and limit his ability to regain health. In the video here we can see that he's regaining health up to 215 points per click, which can really, really add up in this fight. You will have to take advantage of your opportunities to deal damage to him when possible. Always try and bait his SP1. It's much easier to avoid than his SP2, but if you do take him to SP2 like I do in this video, it still is possible to evade. Just make sure there is plenty of space between your champion and him when the animation starts. SP3 will probably kill you, so try and avoid that at all costs. So that was the fight itself, let's break it down and take a closer look at what went on. The first thing I did at the start of the fight was block, hoping to pull off the parry and stun him, which would then give us the opportunity to hit him a couple of times and start the combo. As soon as he takes the air like Tony Hawks like he has in this example here, this is him preparing for his heavy attack. Back the hell up. This will do significant damage, so you do want to avoid this. Just before his heavy animation finishes, there is a small split second window of opportunity for you to begin attacking him and get a combo off. This may require a little practice, so if you don't feel comfortable enough to pull this off, don't worry about it as it could backfire if not timed properly. But this will help you whenever he is regenerating health, so if you can't do it, go for it. After we get the 5 hit combo here, we want to keep to the same system, which is combo, parry, combo, bait special attack, repeat. At this point, the Vulture is about to attempt his SP1. You want to back up out of there. When his glider comes down to swipe you, evade to avoid taking any damage. If you can't evade, it is okay just to block, but if you can, try and evade, because you want to take as little damage as possible just in case you do get caught at some point during this match. After this, it all begins again. Repeat the exact same process, hit the combo, parry, hit the combo and bait his special attack. At this point, I hit him with Scarlet Witch's SP2 before continuing attack. This takes him to his own SP2, but this is okay since I have given him enough space to perform his SP2 without being hit. Well that's my tips on how to beat the Vulture on Master Mode of Marvel's Contest of Champions. Thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this video and I also hope that you feel more confident going into your fight with the Vulture now. If I've helped you, please do like this video and leave me a comment below to let me know how you got on, and also subscribe for more content. I've been Captain Caveman, you've been fantastic, thank you very much and I will see you back here very soon for more Contest of Champions content. Ta-da!